Hey guys, well, I'm so excited about this video blog because obviously oh. there's a guest. <laughs> Hillary Scott is here from Lady A. Can I say that? Of that course. Like cool, the introduction, all of that. It's way easier to say than the whole whole band name, so. Lady yes. Antebellum. Ugh. I feel like I'm just, always gonna pronounce it wrong. I think we're just gonna cut it to Lady A anyway. I think yeah. it's a brilliant idea. <laughs> brilliant. <laughs> So Hillary's here hanging out and I was like, okay, I would love to snag her for a little bit just to chat with oh. you because a lot of viewers here on the blog are more female, yes. mostly are moms, some are working. And so I thought that'd be so fun to talk to you because you're a working mom as well. Oh, thank about you. About kind of just like good tips to have for women out there to implement in their lives to, for working moms. I'll try to give you the best ones I know. <laughs> good, good, that's what I want, Hillary. So I was brainstorming some, so I thought one, which we kind of talked about earlier, which I just appreciate that you, I feel like we were like along the same lines in this thinking of figure out the kind of family that you want to be and make sure that you and your spouse agree on that. Yes. So if you are a working mom, you and your spouse talk about it, that's what you guys value. Or if you want to be a stay at home mom and that's what you guys value, but agreeing with your spouse. Oh my gosh, that's key. first and foremost, because I feel like if, if the two of you aren't on the same page, yes. there's fallout everywhere around it. I mean, my husband and I, we try once a week to sit down and go, okay, here's the week. Even though totally. it feels so formal and weird, it's so important because we've gotten into some discussions, yeah. passionate discussions. <laughs> Relationship about, building opportunities. Yes, exactly. <laughs> Just about forgetting to mention, oh, I had this hair appointment or, oh, Isley has this dance class. And then totally. you, in the moment, you're like, do you guys share calendars? How do you do that? We do. Okay. Yeah, on your phones? like Too many of them, actually. Know, like Spinning around. Oh. Yeah. But it eliminates so much, yeah, when you can communicate and talk about it. So, no, that's what Winston and I do, even to our meals. So, another tip um, that we kind of talked about is having me time. I think it is extremely important mm -hmm. to find time, whether it's even just to go get a pedicure or go walk around the grocery store alone. <laughs> I know. Sometimes that's the most exciting thing thing that you could do and it's like I can actually take my time and I'm not worried exactly. about my little girl grabbing the cinnamon off the spice shelf or whatever you know pulling something down oh my gosh nothing fills my like my soul than to go on, to the grocery store just go to the grocery store or even just um if Chris my husband takes my daughter out of the house for a couple of hours okay. and I can just sit on my couch with a cup of coffee and it's quiet and do nothing huh. it's amazing <laughs> Yes, I think for all moms, for sure, and especially the working moms, because that's totally what oh. we can, I mean, like, oh my gosh, just any time. That's so funny you say that about the grocery store, because we were on a weekend trip, and we were driving past the Publix home, and I was like, Winston, just stop the car. Can I just run in and get what I need? Because I know that she's in the car with him, and I'm yes. like, I can just go, and I can be at the deli section, and I can just sit there. You know what I mean? Like, absolutely. It's, it's an amazing thing. Yes. An absolutely amazing thing. <laughs> and the third piece of advice, which is one of my favorites from Christy Wright, who's another one of our speakers in the yes. business boutique. She does that, and Hillary will be speaking on that. I'm so excited. Which is great. Uh, so Christy talks about life balance and how it's not this, like, 50-50 thing where it's like, okay, half my time spent working, half my time being a mom. You know, it's not perfect. So it's not a 50-50 split, but it's about being 100% present. Oh, that's so good. And it is. When she said that the first time, I was like, oh, my gosh, that's that, that is so true. Cause I'm like, I'm, it's hard to do that, but the more discipline I've gotten personally, I'm like, yes, whether I'm out to lunch with a friend, I'm there and I'm focused. If I'm working, I'm working. Or if I'm being a mom, being a mom. Absolutely. So. That quality sometimes, yes. because there's seasons, especially as a working mom, that I, I was the daughter of a working mom who did the same thing I do. So it, sometimes it's quality over quantity, but making sure that when you do have that time, that it's, whether it's working, whether it's with your family, you make the best of it. Yes, absolutely. So great. Well, okay, Hillary, tell me, speaking of split 50-50 yes. mom working all that, you have a new album yes. out. Okay, so tell me about it because it's amazing. Thank you. So I great. um I put together with my family a faith-based record, and it's really just, I wanted to get back to my roots. I wanted to kind of show a deeper side of, of who I am as an artist, and all of that really starts with my family and my faith. And so I wrote a couple of songs for it. My mom and dad wrote a song. We found some really traditional hymns that we love that we recorded our own versions of. Ricky Skaggs produced the mm. project and it came out at the end of July. And so it's been out a little over a month. And, and it's like killing it, you guys. It's been- It's all over the radio. Oh, it's been the, the most incredible season of life. And Amazing. so um, the juggle is so worth it right now. Yeah, you know? totally. It, it really totally. is. And especially when you know you're right where God wants you to be. Yes. You know, oh like having that, that peace and 
And um, knowing that if you're being obedient to him, he's not going to not make sure your kids are good. You know, in those moments of like mommy guilt or whatever, it's like, he's got her. I know it. Totally. Yeah. Absolutely. Oh, so good. So, so good. Well, so much wisdom, Hillary. Thank you. I love you. it Thank so much. You. Thanks for coming by. Anytime. This guys, is so fun. I so appreciate it. Well, good. Well, guys, make sure to check out everything she's doing, her new album, and all of the above, because not only are you a good singer, but you're really nice. Thank and you. And awesome, Hillary. <laughs> <laughs> she is. Seriously. We had lunch, and I was like, oh, my gosh. And we have, like, mutual friends, and I feel yes. like you are that friend we were talking about, Thank which we you. love. We love her. So, anyways, thanks for coming. All right, Hillary. Well, thank you so much for being here. So appreciate it. So make sure you guys check out all she's doing, her new album, everything. Uh, It's just, it's amazing. So thanks guys again for watching and make sure to subscribe to my channel for more tips, sometimes on life, talking about, you know, working moms, but mostly tips on how to handle your money well. Thanks guys.